Pretend you're making a campfire. You pile up some wood and light it with a match. As the fire burns, the pile of wood seems to shrink. By the time the fire burns out, a pile of ashes is all that's left. Where did the wood go? Did it disappear? No, the molecules that made up the wood did not disappear. Instead, they were rearranged into different molecules. This is called the law of conservation of mass. This law was discovered by a French scientist named Antoine Lavoisier in 1789. As Antoine experimented with fire, he learned that wood and oxygen undergo a chemical change as the fire burns. Molecules of wood are made of elements like carbon, oxygen, and hydrogen. As the wood burns, the molecules break apart. Those same atoms of carbon, oxygen, and hydrogen bond together in new ways to create smoke, ash, water vapor, and carbon dioxide. The wood didn't disappear. It changed into something else. In this experiment, the wood and the oxygen needed to burn it are called reactants. What's left after the fire burns, smoke, ash, water vapor, and carbon dioxide, are called products. Antoine noticed that the mass or amount of the reactants was always equal to the mass of the products. Mass is how much matter is in an object. Let's say the mass of the firewood and the oxygen before lighting a fire is five kilograms. After the wood has burned up and the fire goes out, the mass of the smoke, ash, water vapor, and carbon dioxide is still five kilograms. Matter is not gained or lost during a reaction. It simply changes as elements rearrange to form new substances. We can also see the law of conservation of mass during physical changes, like when water changes states. Say you have an ice cube with a mass of 100 grams. You place the ice cube in a glass and set it in the sun to melt. As the ice melts, it changes into liquid water. The liquid water in the glass still has a mass of 100 grams. Eventually, the water in the glass heats up and evaporates into water vapor. That water vapor still has a mass of 100 grams. The law of conservation of mass says that the amount of matter always stays the same even when chemical or physical changes happen. This video was created by La Fontaine of Knowledge. Click the link in the description for lesson materials that go along with the video and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this.